In this video, I will give you an example of join table in many-to-many -many relation in MySQL. Let's look at these two table in the PubMed publication database. So we have author. Each publication will author here. Author will author ID, author name. The primary key is author ID. And we have article, this publication article. So each article we give a primary key, PubMed ID. Then we have an article title, journal title, publication year, and article object is a test here. So when we think of this relation between author and article, so one author can have many articles and one article can have many authors a first author second author so we need a called join table called author article so let's think about if we don't use join table we just directly put the public id primary key put here in the author. In this case, each author, this is primary key, so each author can have only one PubMed ID, one article. If different authors have the same PubMed ID, that means one article can have many authors. So if we put a PubMed ID here, that means one PubMed ID can have many article, many authors, but one author can only have one article. Similarly, if we put an author ID, put a Follinger key as in this article table, at least here, that means one PubMed ID can ha only have one author. Of course, we have different PubMed we have can put in the same authors. That means one author can have many articles, but one article can only have one author. So, let's in this two case, there's only a many to one to many relation. So, how can we build up many to many relation? We use called join table. We put the author article this join table. Join table we put author ID from this primary key, this this uh, author table. We have a partner ID, this this is the primary key from the article table. In this table we can create an ID integer as a primary key, but this is not required. The basic is we need the author ID from this author table. PubMed ID from this article table. In this case, if we want to search one author ID also related to the article, we can through this join table. Set we can set this author and we use this join table find the author use the PubMed ID. This PubMed ID and related to this article table. Similarly, we can use the PubMed ID to search the author based on this join table. So in summary, if we want to deal with many to many relation in my SQL tables, we need to create a join table here. This join table combine these two primary keys. This also apply to the general relation database, not only MySQL. This MySQL just as an example. So any relation database we need the join table to connect many to many relation uh, tables. Thanks for your watching.